I've got a real soft spot, and I, and I know the family is just just as strong. The country itself has so many resources, and yet five and a half thousand dogs get put down a day. So if we're able to to create, and and this is a really awesome piece I'm about to share with you because we are living it, and I know it as factual. There's a movement that's going on right now, and the movement across this country is to adopt and not shop. And people are almost feeling guilty about getting that purebred that they wanted to have, or you know, going down the path of you know purchasing a puppy. It's it's getting to a stage now. Well, if you if you have a dog, people are going to ask you the question: Oh, is it a rescue? Yes. Ah, oh, you're one of us. Woo! You say, oh no, I paid five grand for this little uh, King Charles Spaniel. Like, are you serious? You, you could have saved a hundred dogs instead of buying. So I think this movement that we're witnessing is is in it's in such high demand, stronger in some states than others, but with companies like the Greater Good and the the Best Friend Society, their awareness level is off the charts. What we're doing is very, very small in comparison, but I think the level that we connect on is the family that's in this together. That is, it, yeah, you're right. It's a lot more personal, but what, it, what it's doing, it's showing people out there that we care enough about something that, that's this bad, that we want to go out and show that our actions speak louder than words but in marrying up with the um, best friend society we're all in this together but it will be a thing of the past when you can get designer dogs i believe in the future if they're not rescued i mean they, something's got to change dramatically because that too, too many too many animals are getting put down every day and it's really really sad so i think that i, I really think we are having an impact and it's the awareness we're, it's, we're really honing in on the awareness Thank you.